What is up YouTube? We are back. And we got some epic bikes out today. Look at this fat bob man. Fun fact actually, Sebastian here on the Harley actually tuned this bike. He is a bike tuner. So yeah, you can thank that guy for this thing being so loud and being so fast. I think most guys you'll see tonight from around this kind of area have been to him to get the bike tuned. So anyway, about the event, I don't know too much about it. I know it's quite a big thing. I think it's a worldwide kind of group. They do different big city meetups. It's not something I've been to before, so we'll check it out. Uh, it goes by the name of Moto Social. And I'll throw in a quick tip for you guys as well. If you're ever riding in a group, especially people you don't know, try ride staggered as we are. So you go like a zip. One, two, one, two, one, two. That way I have all that space between me and the bike in front of me. Same with the bike in front of him. And apparently there's police up here. But this part here is notorious for having police parked up on the sides and you've not been able to see them. I've actually got pulled over here before and it's not gone too well in my favor. But look at this, so this is the Auckland Harbour Bridge. If you haven't seen that before, there's the main city, that's the sky tower, and of course there's the water below. But look at it, look how nice that is. On a summer's day, this looks like a movie, it's insane. Something to see. I'm sure you'll see it if you keep watching this channel long enough. I test rode a Harley not too long ago, a street glide, sport glide, sorry. And this is not helping my case as to not get one. policeman there so unless you're looking to lose your license you got to be sensible today boys but definitely do let me know if you like the kind of ride out videos and I can bring you guys on a lot more I should move over a bit. I should move over. I don't know what I'm singing. Right, big dog, you can jump off. Get off me, cuz. I wonder you like it. You like it. I hate those fluffies, man. No, I'm just joking guys. I did make a video before talking about some points that I'm not the biggest fan of on motorbikes and that was one of those topics. I'll put a link up here. Anyway, let's get into looking around and see what we can find at this meet. As you can see, there's quite a lot of bikes here today, which is awesome for Auckland considering it's quite a small city and you don't realize how many bikes are actually here until you have something like this. But as you can see, we found two electric bikes straight away. Not sure if I'm the biggest fan of them. However, I do like the fact the one on the right, I don't know the brands of these things does look like a dirt bike although without the radiator at the front it does look very strange. Sebastian did have a Sur on so he's quite a fan of these things as you can tell. The fluffies man. The fluffies. Woo. So after that much needed toilet break it was time to have a look around and see what we could find. We came across this Ninja H2, awesome supercharger waddled down a bit further and up came another cool Harley Davidson Fat Bob and this one had skull brake discs. That is crazy. <laughs> Typical MT-07, however, it did sound awesome. And bam, just like that, there is a CBX Honda 1000, I believe that is. That should be a six cylinder inline six. I could be wrong, however, I don't know much about these bikes, but I've never seen one before in the wild and that was a cool find. 
And here we are boring the hell out of Mrs. Tube with the YZFR1 facts that I'm telling her because when I was younger I had this on the wall on the poster. It was a blue one, 1998 I believe, and it's really cool to see one in real life. That is all out, man. And yes, that's a rusted looking Harley Davidson, but that's nothing compared to this thing that we found right next door to it. How the hell does that work? I don't know. It's a three wheel trike thing and it looks like it's on hydraulic wheels that tilts left to right. Apologies for the camera angle. There's not much we can do about that. However, I assume this must be for some sort of disability or something like that. Love to see how it works on the road. Unfortunately, I didn't get to see that. And as we were walking, of course, more damn fluffies. More fluffies. So as you can probably tell, it's getting a bit dark and everyone's starting to head out. So we decided to do the same and head down to a local beach called Mission Bay, which is quite popular. And we got wind that most of these bikes were heading down there. So we thought we'd go for a ride and see where it goes. Yeah, boy. Okay, back with the show. So. There's some water over here. It follows around the coastline. We're going over there. So hopefully when we get there, there's a bunch of bikes. We'll grab some food, call it a night, and see how it goes. So we made it to Mission Bay. There was quite a few bikes. We didn't hang around too much because I was very hungry and tired. So we decided to go across the road and grab a burger and wrap the night up just like that. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you like this kind of video. Let me know if you do and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.